Hey Dave, welcome to the BGT After Party and I'll be discussing the BGT, the topics and issues that we're supposed to cover. So the first question is, what do you like most about the project? And I would say the fact that we were given the option to choose any topic that we wanted from the syllabus. So if you understand a topic more than others, you have the option of choosing it. You can do anything that you wanted. We got to choose our own group, so if you like a group of people, you could have chosen them, you could have go with anybody that favored. You could have basically done anything that you wanted, any idea that you had, you could have done it for the video, so you didn't have a problem with that. Question 2. What did you like least about the project? I think that 15% was a lot to be put on one project. It was a lot of marks, so even if you did bad in the project, you would have lost about 15% of your final grade, and I think that was too much of marks for just one project. The other thing, other issue that I had with the project is that the time limit for the video, it could have been longer, 15 minutes was a lot of time, but most of the ideas and some of the biochemistry that we need to be, that need to be spoken about was um, was very long, so this is, was the other issue that we had with the project. The third question was, how can the BGT video project be improved? So, I don't really think that this project could be improved more than how it was, because we had a lot of instructions, a lot of manual, we had a lot of help, we even had suggestions on what we could have done for the video, such as like talk shows, interviews, and stuff like that. Um, we even had a marking scheme, so we even got shown that what we was getting marked for, so we could have known specifically what to put in the video and what not to put. So the fourth question was the major challenges in the project. I would say one of the biggest challenges that we had was finding a time and place to film. This was very hard, since most of the rooms were usually occupied or only time that we wanted to film. And um, when we do get the rooms and them available, it was almost time for the buildings to be locked up. And this was very, very hard for us to find the rooms and the time. Another major issue that we had was as a group project, and it's always difficult to gather everyone for a meeting, for everybody to discuss their views on the video or what they wanted to do. And it's hard because people do different courses in the group and you need to work with everyone time and sometimes it is not convenient because you have to come to a group meeting just before class so that was probably one of the hardest thing to discuss any project between the group some people did not put any input into it they were just listening to the other people in the group so it's just like one or two persons opinion that gained voice and the other people didn't have that much input that was just going along with everything else we were saying. The other issue was everybody needs to be open minded since it's a group project and people need to listen to everybody's opinion and let their voice their views about what they think or what they want to go on in the video. Other challenges with this video was balancing it with other assignments and work. Since this video needed to be done when people didn't have classes or when group members didn't have much work. So other challenges with this video project is balancing it balances the video project with um, other assignments and uh, other work since it was a group project everybody needed to be available. Other challenges with this video project was balancing the video time work since we had other assignments and everything. We need to find a time and place where all our work was completed for the week and this was kind of hard because everybody else in the group needed to have need to be free in order for us to be filming. So this was one of the other major topics. We needed to be balancing work and we need to balance other assignments and everything with the video project. Question five was the benefits of this project. One of the benefits of this project, especially to me, was I learned how to edit pretty well video editing and it opened up my eyes to like to new field and acting all more since I was exposed to new video programs and this allowed me to just venture out of my zone which is biology and to do something else. The other thing that's very useful about this video project is that I learned the urea cycle more in depth than I would have done 
in the body diseases and the body effects, the enzyme deficiencies and everything else. And plus we explain it in a way that we understood it compared to how it normally be taught.